Hi guys, welcome to the next part of my framework. So we're going to be talking about Mary Whitehouse now. She hails from the West Coast. Um, Mary used DMT concepts and she combined it with Jungian analysis, which I too find myself doing quite often. Some of the concepts that she found important in her work as a dance movement therapist was kinesthetic awareness, the use of polarity, active imagination, authentic movement, and therapeutic intuition. Kinesthetic awareness is the idea of noticing how it feels to move the way we do and to feel our internal experience. One of the ways in which I've used this in New Hope is sometimes I'll ask the clients, so how does it feel to move your body slow? How does it feel to move your body with strength? Do you like it? No? Yes? That way they're actively participating in the process of figuring out how they feel when their body moves through the space in this particular way. The use of polarities. Um, Mary believed that polarity was involved in all aspects of life and that life was not black or white. I do believe the same thing. And the use of polarities have been really interesting to be used at New Hope because a lot of the clients are at varying levels of ability. So some of the clients would be tapping their feet, for an example, in group. And then other clients would not be moving at all. So one intervention that I might pose to the group would be to explore our feet stepping really fast or, and then having them explore their feet moving really slow. And I noticed that when I used that intervention that some of those folks who were not moving at all actually began to move a little bit. So I too find polarity important in, in our work with dan dance movement therapy clients. Active imagination. Here's a quote by Mary Whitehouse that I found helpful in my process. There's no limit and no guarantee of consistency, images, inner voices. They move suddenly from one thing to another. The levels come from one 